Tech Thing from CES 2018. I'm Patrick Norton, and let us talk about storage because everybody needs more storage. If you're looking for another way to get your 3, 2, 1 backups that we're always telling you to do, let us talk about the CES 2018 announcements from Western Digital and SanDisk. Now, a couple of years ago, I doubled the storage on my old XPS 13 for like a year and a half with a SanDisk UltraFit. That's one of these tiny guys. I could have tripled it with the new 256 gigabyte SanDisk UltraFit. Going to be $149. It's the world's smallest 256 gigabyte drive. USB 3.1, the, the phrase they're coming up with from the crew at SanDisk is plug and stay. And given that I plugged this into a side of a laptop and left it there for a year, I could totally be down with that. And this will fit anywhere. That space behind the router, if you don't want to plug a big USB drive in there, or any of your devices, your console, something that needs a little bit more storage. This has a lot of potential. Laptop, media servers, routers, whatever. Now, if your laptop only has Type-C USB, don't worry. Imagine, if you will, a tiny one terabyte USB-C thumb drive. Those are on the way. Now, if you're thinking about small, fast storage on the go, check out the SanDisk Extreme Portable SSD. IP55, dustproof, water resistant. I want to say it's like 30 minutes at one meter. Don't leave it under the water. Pull it out quickly, but it won't be destroyed. This thing looks slick. 129 bucks for a 200 gigabyte version. One terabyte is going to run $399. Two terabyte, well, we don't have pricing on that, but this thing is tiny, like half the size of a pack of cards, and it should be super fast. For the pros out there that want to back up their photo shoots, drone footage, or well, anything a whole lot faster, the My Passport Wireless has now gone SSD. This is a big update to the My Passport Wireless Pro that has been out for the last year or two. Those are regular hard drives, like one terabyte's 149, four terabytes is 219. And again, photographers, videographers, drone pilots, plug your SD card into it, it automatically adjusts the content. One touch card copy is slick. Battery will power it for 10 hours. They say it's good to go for 4K wireless streaming. One meter drop endurance, although I suggest you not test that raw image preview views are available inside of that. Oh, and it's a wireless access point too. You can attach it to Wi-Fi or to your MyCloud network at home. Two terabytes for $799, 250 gigabytes for $229, one terabyte for $499. There's other sizes in there, so it's a lot more expensive than the regular hard drive version, but it's going to be a lot faster. And if you're in the field trying to get video copied off your SD cards as fast as you can, that is a good thing. More tech coming at you from CES 2018. Head over to techthing.com or youtube.com slash techthing. Shannon's got videos, I've got videos. The best of CES 2018 televisions is going to be up there. Go get your tech on, people. I'm Patrick Norton. Thank you so much for watching.